Hey guys, it's Kez, and today I'm playing Kitty Powers Matchmaker with my special assistant. Um, he's my Mr. Handsome. He's my dog, Taiko. Uh, Cerberus is in his house taking a nap. He's a little black dog. Uh, I know you can't see us, but, you know, Taiko's here, lying on the ground, enthusiastic to help me out. And, you know, they say dogs make pretty good matchmakers, so maybe he'll, you know, give me some of that good luck and things will work out between these two. Anyway, uh, Paul Kalsha in the comments and I decided that Jared might be, you know, worth pursuing further, and there's no harm in going on a second date anyway, so uh, let's just go on a date with him. We already have his particulars written down, and we already wrote down that we uh, talked about, let's see, chess. Oh, wait, that's what he's interested in. But yeah, we already talked about chess, we already talked about his activity level, and we already talked about uh, hair, I guess. I forgot to write that down. Activity, chess. Uh, she told him that she was into movie premieres. Okay. Her activity level movie premieres is what she said. He talked about chess. I need to figure out how to take better notes on this. And they talked about the hair. Anyway, I've got everything straightened out now. Mm. Let's just go on the state. Now, we've already been to the U.S. restaurant. So, let's, uh, let's just keep an eye on this one and pick any of the others. So, I'm gonna watch close. So let's go to this one. Yeah! Ooh. Mario's Mansion. You're off to Mario's Mansion. Bring me a doggy bag. Psycho likes doggy bags. Let's just go on this date. Okay, clear skies. Let's draw a little sun. Even though it's not sunny, huh? You, you know, whatever. <laughs> Hello, Jared. Nice to see you again. Yeah, nice one, Adam. Oh, I didn't know right click Jared too. I like all these posh gaps you keep bringing me to. Aww. It is very nice, isn't it? Okay. So, um... She kind of looks like me. Uh... Waitress. So we know she's female. Uh, looks like me with short hair. Uh, a bit darker though. And makeup. So, um, a pretty version of me. <laughs> okay, yes please. What would you like? I think I want something hot with no meat. Okay, hot with no meat. Uh... I don't know what any of this shit is. I know that that's chicken, but um <laughs> octopus salad, so that's out with aubergine and tomato syrup cold. That sounds delicious. Um, what's the minestrone? Homemade vegetable and noodle soup. <laughs> Two portions of minestrone, please. <laughs> uh, may I say, what's the period choice that is? <laughs> yeah. It sounds lovely. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? <laughs> Pull that love handle. I'm gonna need to move to a new sheet in a second. Okay, we already talked about activity. Uh, we can talk about the next of his interests, so let's just save him. I'll take a scratching. Uh, let's ask him about his interest in aliens. Yeah, I flippin' love aliens. What a distracting distraction. That sounds really exciting. Oh, she's into it. Yeah, it's all good, eh? So, what do you like doing? Okay, we already told him that we like movie premieres. Let's talk about spooky stories. <laughs> Let's just write that down. Uh, interest. Let's check next to aliens and spooky stories. <laughs> oh, that sounds well done. <laughs> yes, it is actually. Okay, so far so good. Their, their interests are pretty um, compatible with each other. Ah. Hold that love handle. Okay, we have not asked about their jobs yet. She probably won't be impressed with this. So, Jared, what do you do for a living? I'm a hotel door attendant from Sins. Oh. 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 I wouldn't want that job. It's a bit flippin' rude, isn't it? So, what do you do for a job, Banana? I'm an ornithologist. <laughs> That's wicked, isn't it? No, it's not me, really. Got any ripping yarns to tell me? Oh, ripping yarns. I just finished socks, so... Oh, yes, this is a good one. Ooh, this should be good. 
Okay, I need to make a pair. Nope. No. Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. I drifted out to sea on Lilo and had to be rescued. This was pretty terrible. Yeah, it wasn't much fun to be honest. Uh, that was, oh, that was my bad. I could have spent more, but look at how limited our funds are. Um, let's talk about clothes. So what do you think my outfit? Car, love it. Oh, you So, do you like mine? Just be honest. She guesses it's okay. <laughs> this date's not going nearly as well as the first one. Let's give him 8%. Okay, so... Um... <laughs> this many. Oh. Shh, blimey, you rolled brand new too. Not really, it was easy. It's time to make a move. Oh, make a move as in leave. Okay, it was getting late, I suppose. <sighs> I could take them or leave them really- WHY?! Ugh! Oh. Okay, so I'll just put a little frowny face with a wistful love heart next to it. Oh man, I was really hoping this would go a lot better. Uh, let's see. Uh, spooky stories, jobs that didn't go well, and then we talked about their clothes, which didn't go well. Uh, oh, she doesn't even want to go out with him. We'll just say, can I see you again? <laughs> yeah, he had a terrific time. Oh, she didn't, though. Um, oh, we could risk it and go on a third date. But... If we do that, then that would count as a strike on us. I mean, we still get three strikes per customer, but still, eh, you know. Yes. I'd forgotten how much fun dating is. <laughs> so, uh, that's how that went with, uh, Jared here. Um, hmm. Well, Hayden still looks promising. Um, we're going to skip on Benedict, because they didn't, they didn't fit well to begin with, so... Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> I guess I'll see you guys next episode. Let me know what you think about, um, you know, playing with these three. Or maybe we can try Santiago here. Santiago Nibble Down. Uh, I need to organize my notes anyway, so I think I'm done for the day. But, uh, yeah. I guess I'll see you guys next- uh, I'll see you guys in the next episodes. Bye! Love you!